Among Us chat. Sorting algorithms. If you're into computer science, chances are you've heard of these before. A sorting algorithm is an algorithm that takes a bunch of items and sorts them according to some property. Given a list of numbers, a sorting algorithm could sort them from lowest to highest. Or given a bunch of colors, a sorting algorithm could sort them into a rainbow. There are infinitely many ways a sorting algorithm can be coded. Some are more efficient than others. One popular and efficient sorting algorithm is called quicksort, which uses pivots to sort in a divide and conquer type of style. Another sorting algorithm is called bubble sort. Bubble sort uses repeated swapping to sort the list. No matter the application, sorting comes up all the time in programming. But what about in Minecraft? Can you make a sorting algorithm with redstone? I recently studied sorting algorithms for school, and that's what prompted my interest on this. Given a bunch of signal strength values, can you sort them with just redstone? So just for fun, I started trying to make a bubble sorter with redstone. A bubble sort uses one mechanic over and over again. It compares two different values that are right next to each other and swaps them if they're in the wrong order. If you repeat this enough times in enough places, you'll end up with a sorted list of signal strengths. I thought this would be a pretty easy mechanic to do with redstone because you can compare two signal strengths with a comparator, right? All you need to do is switch on subtract mode and compare the back value with the side value. Then you can use the output of the comparator to tell you whether or not you need to swap. And after a few hours, I finished this guy. This is a signal strength bubble sorter. It's actually pretty fun to watch. I was proud of it and sent it to my buddies on the OR Discord. And of course, someone already made it way faster and way better. <sighs> Come on guys, you can't be good at everything. This is Oscar91's bubble sorter. It takes 17 ticks from input to output, and it's 5 hertz, which means it can sort 5 sets per second, where a set is 8 signal strengths. This thing is absolutely insane. But how does it work? Well, the way it works is with this magic circuit right here. This circuit inverts both the signal strengths, which means it takes 15 minus what they used to be, and then it puts the lower value on the left and the higher value on the right, all in just two ticks. For example, if you input two and four, it will invert them, making them 13 and 11, and then the 11 goes on the left because it's lower, and the 13 goes on the right because it's higher. The first stage of this sorter uses four of these magic circuits, so now our list gets a little bit more sorted. However, now the list is inverted, so what now? Now. Well, inverted signal strengths can still be sorted, it's just that now the priority is opposite of what it used to be. For example, if you have 5 and 3 and you ask which one's bigger, obviously it's 5. But when you invert them, now they become 10 and 12, and so an inverted 3 is actually bigger than an inverted 5. In fact, any number that's smaller in the normal realm becomes bigger in the inverted realm. So if we attach another row of these magic circuits which face the opposite direction to account for the inversion, it will just continue sorting. The list gets inverted for a second time, which means that you're back to your normal list. If you repeat that setup three more times, your list will come out fully sorted. Again, huge thanks to Oscar91 for showing this to me. This is pretty genius. So genius that the man said, yeah, it's impossible to make it any faster. And I thought, no way. Let's prove him wrong and make a faster one. After hours and hours and hours, I was beginning to lose hope. No matter what I did, it seemed like the magic circuit couldn't get any faster. Unless I completely redesigned the sorter, there's just no way I could- wait, redesign? There's other types of sorts. And then I realized counting sort could be faster. A counting sort is pretty simple. You count up how many of each type you have and then you reconstruct the list based on those counts. For example, if I have the list 43543, I count two threes, two fours, and one five. Then I can just go through those counts and reconstruct the list in order. I had seen circuits that count things in Minecraft before, they're called unary counters, so I thought, let's give it a try. And after a couple of days and some help from my buddies, Fearless and Sloimy, we did it. This is a five hertz sorter that takes 11 ticks from input to output. This circuit generates random signal strength lists at five hertz, and the output is all of the sorted lists coming out 11 ticks later. So although I didn't make a faster bubble sorter, I definitely made a faster sorter, and after spending way too much time on this, I was satisfied. Is any of this actually useful for redstone builds? Mmm, probably not. But I learned a lot about sorting algorithms, and it helped me pass my final in school too. I would explain the details of how it works, but instead, I'm gonna leave you with a little bit of a challenge. I wanna see if you guys can make a sorter that's even faster, using any method that you want. The requirements are that the input and output both look like this. You can use any components you want, just not command blocks. It would be really cool for it to be 5 hertz as well, but then you can't use torches, so don't worry about that if that's what's stopping you from making one. If you make one that's faster than 11 ticks, I'll show it off and shout you out in a video. That's all I got. I hope you learned something. I hope you enjoyed. Peace out, guys. If they show love, I'ma show it back. If the catch is too small, I'ma throw it back. I've done a lot, but I ain't got a lot to show for that. Alright, yeah, let's do that again.